here. I like from my directors, Staki, uh, uh, we discuss. We get up and they are Nisa. Uh, Venerable Joseph is our architectonary. Yeah, Roiro. So, Staki, I be a Chunga Joangu. I be discommunicated from the church. So, uh, but But also, a person we have worked together here for a number of years. Adiposkia hii maneno amefika hapa. Na sio mwingine ni uh, Auleri Arono. Auleri Arono is the PS in uh, parliamentary services under the office of uh, um, uh, Honorable Musari Mudavadi. Na amekuja hapa kuleta rabi rabi zake. And I hope all of us who are here will be inspired that you could be seated here today. Next time, Uretu and a bodyguard, Nagari and Gufu and Yenimeona, Madame Pierce. Sasa to Karibise, Madame Pierce, for my coffee, my coffee, my coffee, Karibu, Madame. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Munene. Uh, our clergy, members of family. Uh, all of us, good afternoon. Good afternoon. good afternoon. I know you're really scorching in the sun, and uh, I would not want to take a lot of time. Uh, my name is Aurelia Rono, as it has been said. I'm the principal secretary, State Department for Parliamentary Affairs, in the office of the Prime Cabinet Secretary and Ministry of Foreign and Diaspora Affairs. I did not manage to come yesterday to the church, and uh, next week I will not be around, I will not make it. Then I chose to come and condole with the family, the students, the relatives, and the friends today. My chapter, my story, sorry, has a whole chapter belonging to this lady who rested. When I graduated in 2007 at Egerton University, I came to Nairobi, and 2008, I went to an institution. Uh, that time, it was in a cooperative, cooperative house um, in Nairobi. I looked, I requested for a position to serve in this uh, high institution and I was accepted. It was in this college. So we, we grew, I grew up there, cooperative, uh, at cooperative, then we went to Ronald Gala, and then uh, before that, at Gacha House, then we went to Ronald Gala. By that time, she was constructing here, then we came here. So I served with her from 2008 to 2013. So it's a whole chapter in my life. It was in this institution where I changed my career. I graduated at Egerton University as a, a science uh, teacher. I did education, uh, maths and chemistry, which is science. But when I came here, I was given an opportunity. This lady, wonderful lady here of rested, could give people opportunities. I was given an opportunity uh, to also assist the business department in, uh, by lecturing mathematics units. That's when I realized that uh, in business studies, you apply what you learn in uh, the science environment. It is here where I decided, because she used to encourage us, to tell us that you can be whatever you want to be in life, only if you work hard and smart, if you are committed, and if you believe in God. It was here where I changed the... Uh, the directors who are here are men of, and women of growth. One of Funzi was as the well as preparatory, Walim, and everybody, good afternoon. If you can see me, just wave at me, please. Just wave at me. Thank you. Thank you. I will lead a tribute on behalf of NIPS Technical College staff, 
and also this one we get prepared actually. Just like the Bible tells us of the right and sort of the world. Indeed, Madam Lizzie Wanyoike was our right and was our sort. She was a beacon of hope to all of us. Let me sample a few feelings uh, from people who, after learning of her demise, said as follows. There is a student who wrote this. I remember her to be a very jovial and loving woman. When she came to our church and I introduced myself as the head of IT in the church, she was so happy to hear that. I am a student from her college and she said, and I will quote, I'm so proud of you. Continue with the good work. It is never in vain. Indeed, she has left an amazing legacy for all of us to remember. Lizzie, less well, and you will be forever remembered. And this is a student called Shalom from the ICT department. Another is a student, a student who later became NIPS staff. Over almost that student, who we had trained have been employed at NIFS, taking Kokorid or Lizzie Wanyuike Preparatory. And this is what they had to say about the dummies. We as NIFS alumni would like to give gratitude to our mom, Madam Lizzie, for sharing our lives, for saving Remember how you visited us in class just to say hi and check on us. You would then casually ask, are you happy? And we would say a resounding yes. You would then smile at us, wave and say, say hi to your parents and tell them I love them. Madam Lizzie, we celebrate your life. We will take all your life teaching to make our lives better. We will emulate your humility and selflessness to be people of substance in future, just like you. We want it said of us that we inherited the attributes of our school director, that we inspire and give hope to those who have despaired. Madam Lee.